All right, 616, let's get over to the Bob Mills Weather Center. Jed, you've got the out-the-door forecast. Yes, yes we do. Yeah, kids on spring break, so we've got out-the-door this week. And as you check out the forecast, I think you'll like the afternoon temps. They will rebound up into the 60s today, a windy forecast today. Winds kick in as that sun comes up here about 8 o'clock this morning. We'll start to see those winds kick in, and they'll be up in that 20, 30-mile-per-hour range much of the day today. And there might even be a few gusts even higher than that. So temperatures... Last uh, 12 hours, they were in the mid to low 50s around the metro yesterday. Overnight, they have fallen into the 40s. We dropped down to near 40 for a while here overnight. We are now in the upper 30s. That's about where we start. Let's check out the next uh, 12 hours. We look through the day today. We'll go from the 30s, 40s into the 50s. And by about lunchtime, just after that, we'll climb above 60. And we'll top it out in the middle 60s here coming up for today. It looks like a nice mild afternoon, but that will come with a lot of wind today. So good day to be outside. But again, just remember the wind is going to be a factor. Good kite day here coming up for today. 36 southeast winds at 9. Wind chill checks in at 29. So it is a cold morning starting off. Winds will increase. Watch the winds really kick in as you see there about 15 to 30. Some gusts higher. A lot of wind here across central, northern, northwest Oklahoma. And for a while, some areas up in northwest Oklahoma will have some gusts up above 40. So the higher the profile of the vehicle with those south winds, kind of tougher to drive on those east-west roads. So Make sure you're paying attention there. Stay off your phone and Mike, make sure you will got both hands on the wheel with all that blustery weather here coming up for today. The metro area winds, again, through about 9 o'clock, they'll be about 20 miles per hour. They shoot upward about 30 to 40 miles per hour going into the afternoon hours today. So windy conditions, milder conditions, 58 at lunchtime. We'll close it on 66, about 4 o'clock here coming up for today. Checking your morning temps, ranging in the 30s, uh, low 40s for most spots. We've come up since yesterday where we're in the 20s and low 30s. Still a little cold out there, though, with enough wind. Wind chills range upper 20s. That's where we're at in the metro. 29 also in Clinton, a few low 30s around as well. So cold ones starting off, but temperatures should climb back up. Uh, low 60s east. Mid 60s central, and then expect to see some upper 60s to near 70 out here in West Oklahoma, climbing as high as 76 out toward Guymon. Here come the changes as a cold front arrives in northwest parts of the state tomorrow morning. Much of the state will be mild out ahead of that. Gulf moisture will be streaming upward into the state coming up, coming up for tomorrow. And we'll have a chance to close in on about 70 here in central Oklahoma for a while late tomorrow morning uh, into probably early lunch period. And then here comes the cold front blasting in. Watch it blow on in as that front noses down through the state. As you see, the temperatures there dropping into the 50s, the 40s, and these blue areas. Don't be surprised if there's some 30s there as that colder air rushes back down into the state. But out ahead of that cold front, temperatures will be warmer, unstable across southern and southeast Oklahoma. So some storms expected, especially through eastern, central, and eastern parts of Oklahoma. And some of those can be severe. So golf ball size hail, winds to 65, and there will be a low tornado threat. What you need for tornadoes, you need rotating type thunderstorms. And we'll have some of those develop across southern into southeast parts of Oklahoma. The brighter the intensity probably means the, the more uh, rapidly they will be rotating. Got some moderate to almost strong rotation on those storms. Those are called supercells. Those create the large hail the damaging winds, and that tornado threat as well. So we'll monitor that as we go into tomorrow. Trackers will be ready to go. May see a little bit of snow in northwest Oklahoma. Don't see a major problem there, but maybe a little dusting or a little light coating of some snow in some spots in northwest Oklahoma Thursday, even before the air turns colder. Those colder temps hang around on into Friday. That is St. Patrick's Day. Our highs only near 49. That starts another stretch of colder air that settles on in starting Friday. 50 Saturday, but some 40s, low 40s on Sunday, 40s again Monday for starting to sneak it back up to the 50s, the 60s, trying to end at 70 at the end of that nine day. We also have a few storm chance there as well. So warm it, warmer weather coming up today into tomorrow. Colder though for your weekend.